Hello people on YouTube, it's me again for another review. Today we're going to kind of go over some of the figures that I have not reviewed yet. Sorry about that, I need to drink. Um, as you can see, you can see like, some of them in the shot. Uh, I'm going to go over these uh, one at a time. So basically we'll go over the brute. And I'll tell you what, which uh, series they're out of. It's the brute, anyway. Uh, uh, the weapons from this, I do not have the weapons. Uh, there was, I think, was the uh, frag grenade, the uh, spiky grenade, and I think it was a. It was a, it was some type of weapon, and then there's a piece of armor gone from this. It kept kept popping up. That's quite tough still. And then we had a helmet for the head. Quite nice detail on the head, I should say, because they did uh, the hair, because they're quite hairy beasts. The left does not open, just to say, it's locked in that position. But nice detail at all over. There's nice detail here, even with the crotch piece here, uh, the hair on the uh, feet. And the toes, the back. There's a kind of diamond here. There are two jags out there. Another diamond there. Weirdly enough, a bit. It comes out as blue on the camera, so it's actually green. Same up here. Well, articulation for this guy is quite easy. He has, uh, he has 360 with the head and up and down as well. I think, and then he got 360 with the arm up and down like that. He got a bicep, uh, a swivel here because it's quite tight on mine. Got another swivel here. I think he, yeah, rotate there. And then I think, yeah, it's gonna hinge here. So I take with the opposite side, except that can't go 360. I think it goes that far. I can go, can go 360 this way. Now the legs, uh, it's got an ab crunch, ab crunch. And then it's got uh, nearly 360 with the leg. It's got a, a swivel. It's got a, for the the. It's got a. With a nice tight clicky joints swivel and then another swivel at the bottom. Okay. So basically this is from the same I think this is from the same series, the EOD in white. Uh this I picked up from Entertainer Saving with this guy. I figure a couple of these fi uh, these figures I actually picked from uh Entertainer. This came with two machine pistols. Uh, nice detail all around. The head's quite nice. Uh, with this side, his, his joints are quite loose on his legs, being honest. Okay, uh, back. Let's go. Up. Let's just go over it. Backpack. Backpack's quite nice detail. A bit of green here, and this green on the leg here. Even detail the uh, bottom of the feet. The feet are quite detailed. Uh, weirdly enough, I've pulled this chest off and just held it by pegs. Articulation: you got 360 with the head. Same with what he had. Uh, you go, uh, uh, go yes or no. It can't go, can't do this. It can go in. Yeah, I think you can 360. Yes, but you have to watch out for the armor plate in here. Yeah, it's got, it's got a rotated here. You got a ball here. It rotates there and at the wrist itself. And you got a ball joint at the hand. 
So I'll take a from the opposite side. <coughs> uh, Ab Crouch as he has. So this one go 360. It's got Harry Ball joint in here. It has a, another heat and cheating rotate there. I think at the up no. It's got another clicky. You really can't hear it. It's got clicky one at the uh, toe, and it rotates at the t at the foot as well. I think these were from the Halo uh, Six series. I think, all, uh, I think it was Halo 6 or the Halo 4 series. Not Halo 4, Halo 6 or the 5th. Uh, 6th or 5th. I think you probably can tell me, just, just tell me below. This figure is quite hard to stand because of its feet. You know what? I was going to put the one on the floor. Um, next lot is the figures that were from Reach that I actually picked up, but I'm quite in. They're all right at the moment. Here is the Grunt Ultra, as we all knew. Uh, when you get this out of package, this is took this being popped off like this. The helmet. And the mask. So unless it's like that in the package, and all you need to do is just put pop that on, and then pop the the mask on like that. But let's go over the oh, let's go over the detail of the actual face. Flipping out, lots of one above up above. Um, the mask the mask just goes the uh, hole goes right over its trap. Then the and then the whole mask clips at the back of the head and it just goes falls around it or goes around the whole head as you can see. <coughs> Detail on this is quite nice. It's got like that dirty uh, effect to it as you can see on his backpack. I don't think he's got dirt up here. I don't think that's. I think that's just dirt over time. Um, articulation, you got a ball joint here. I don't know the head last. Ball joint. Uh, a hinge here. I think there is a. No. You got an ab crunch. <coughs> the head's got a butt. It uh, goes up and down, left and right. And. Look, could look up, 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 all way up and down if the mask wasn't on on this guy. Legs, you got bulge, you got a, a rotating swivel here, hinge here, nothing at the foot, nothing at the hands. The weapon this this comes with that actually some people actually know of is the plasma pistol, as some people already know. And there's the Grunt Ultra. Put off there. And there he goes. The grunt is very top heavy or back heavy. You have to get him in the right position to do it. Next one. The pan the elite that can't stand up what's over in uh, the reach. The officer. Well the figure that couldn't stand up. The officer had <coughs> the officer had one plasma grenade. I've probably not got anymore. I think I actually had it. On. I did actually have him on George. Uh, he had a helmet and a covenant uh, battle. You know what came with this anyway, because you saw in the game and the figure already had. This is, this is quite late though, because I actually just thought of doing this, because... Uh, I need something to review. Uh, you d uh, the detail on this is quite nice. It, uh, this is uh, like a bright orange, not a light orange as it looks on uh, the camera. you got a bit of gold here. you got grey, black, 
uh, white here, and then that's actually gold, not silver. Detail all over, and and it does actually have like two pegs in the side of its leg, and I think, yeah, the EOD had that as well. Uh, uh can this thing stand up? It depends how you, if you can stand. Oh, yeah, I've got standing, but uh, detail. Uh, head's quite nice. Uh. Chess, I mean the abdomen. Oh, I've already went off over this, I already have a uh, Articulation, you got uh, full rotation with the head. You got another rotate, rotate here. And then you got a ball joint there as well, underneath it. Three sixty to the arm. Three sixty here. And you got a, a hinge as well. You got a uh, rotate here and a hinge. And weirdly enough, you got a pin and so pin pin the uh, fingers. Same with the opposite side. This side. Legs. You got a 360. You got a. As everybody knows, at least have these. Has a a joint here. Swivel and a ball at the foot. <laughs> There's the, the offset. Next figure that I have, that from the same line. We all know this. Who this is? It's George from uh, Noble Team. I think it was called. Yes. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, uh, the things I'm missing from this is his turret, obviously, and his backpack. I lost that ages ago. The weapons from this, I have them stored somewhere. I don't know where the tin is. I actually have a tin full of the weapons from these. But anyway, let's go over the detail. I uh, see that's the UNSC uh, symbol there. So I if my camera's not picking all of this detail up. Sorry. Uh, silver. From the current say this is a gold. It is it's more of a mustardy colour. White barrel here. Uh, dark green. Dark red. Silver. Back pack, back. Not quite a bit of de yeah, detail. All over. You got a bit of. Uh, Grey here, like it looks like it's coming out. It's uh, like another type of green. The arms are the uh, the uh, are a different size to her original um, Spartan. Because here's here's uh, George against a the EOD I had. Basically, he shoulders here and he shoulders there. Basically, he's had a little bit off because if you pull there, he's uh, his arms was right here, and he's way way bigger than uh, a normal Spartan. But let's go through his uh, articulation. He got a ball joint at the head. He go up and down. I can go that far up. Oh yeah, it hasn't actually got a gold, gold like bronze. It goes silver, as it's, you see. Uh, um, full rotation of the arm. Can go up and down that far, that far up, that far down. It has a rotate here. It's got a uh, a uh, hinge there as well. You can kind of hear. And then he's got ball joint, ab crunch again. Uh, you got full 360 with the leg, I think. Yes, you can. Yeah. Then you got a hinge here. You got a rotate. You got a sp uh, swivel as well underneath it. You got a a lovely clicky joint at the at the foot, and it's got another one at the toe. But you really can't hear it. Oh, well, there you are. 
that's I think the last one of the reach. Yes, I have one left to do after this one. They're all the reach figures I have. I was just size comparison of all of them uh, against each other afterwards. Okay. This one is the oh you know who this is. Uh, this is the Halo Anniversary Armator. Because originally I did actually I got into these around. I think it was like 2010. Maybe 2010, 10, uh, 2011. Even around there. But here's the Arbiter. These uh, lovely silver armor. So let's compare it with another type of Elite. He's a little bit short. Compared to a officer, well, he's skilled though. So I'm, to, I'm rubbing my eyes because I just want a couple of confidence ago. <laughs> but the arbiter comes with a energy sword, a energy sword, uh, and it's in silver armor. Lovely silver armor. Lovely detail as well. All over head, chest, even the legs are mostly details. We like here and the feet. The feet got like that, like uh, bra uh, black, like darker uh, silver. The back. You could store your energy sword on it here, but I don't really think you would. Uh, Articulation, I mean the uh, face. His eyes are there, right there. Yeah, his mouth is quite, is quite nice. It looks like he's about to eat you. It looks like a predator. Well, anyway, anyway, let's go over its uh, articulation. It's got several joints in the neck and the head. You got a uh, one there. Yeah, one here. You basically you can do that. Uh, you can't really do. You you really can't look up, but it can look right down. Uh, I think you get three sixty with the arm. Then you can't. I think I've locked his arm in that position now. Oh yes, you can go 360, only if you pull the joint. Is that? Okay, the arm, that arm could not go 360, it's got a, it's got a pin there, ball joint at the arm, I think this could go 360, yes that could go 360, it does that, that far, the same with the opposite line, it's got the same, it's got basically got the same joint, except this arm is actually open, the only reason why that's not open is because of the energy sword, uh, you got a, uh, you got a, a lovely 360 with the leg. You got a, a swivel onto that. And then you got a uh, clicky joint with a pin. And you got a, uh, I think it is a. A hit? No, it's just, a, it's just an A ball joint that can go sideways. Well, there you go. That's the avatar. Now, uh, let's go do a size comparison with, with some of the Spartans I have. There's George against him. 
if he can actually stand up properly. He's a little bit taller. The grunt is going to be a little bit smaller. There's the grunt. And there you go, uh, George. With George and the elite, uh, the elite officer would have to go on the back wall because due to his feet, their feet, they can't stand up for shit. And if you can get the feet at the uh, the feet in the right place, they will actually stand up properly. Yep. Brute. And the ego D. Just like we get the same. And the opter. I don't know why the joint is so loose in the arbiter's leg. Then lastly, not one not least, the one you can't actually see the head of is the grunt. Oh, let's go back. There you go. That's all my Halo figures that to date I have picked no Halo figures for how long? The rest of the Halo figures I have picked up. The rest of, I mean, the uh, Halo Anniversary I never picked, I picked up uh, him. I was going to pick up Master Chief and Kutana. And I think uh, Duke, I think, was the other one. And Halo 4, I will pick some of them up. I think the only ones I'll probably pick up is the Prometheus Knight, the Watcher, the Crawler, Master Chief himself. Kutana if he's if she's in the series, and the elite or uh, elite or a grunt from that series. Well, thank you for watching. Do not forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to uh, like this video. Bye.